Happy Sabbath. Have you been kind all week, Prayer Partners? Oh, uh, what's a fiesta without a refreshing drink? How about some peach infused water with mint? That's it. Just take the fruit and put it in some water. Simple and easy. Oh, but wait, sometimes we struggle. We want more and more and more. And we might naturally struggle with the fruit of the spirit of kindness. If we, if your kindness is sometimes held back because of fear of rejection. Boy, oh boy. It's the woulda, shoulda, coulda. I really wanted to bless them, but I don't think they would accept what I'm doing. They wouldn't catch it that way. They might misinterpret what I'm trying to do. If that's the case, let's clarify our intentions. Some people might think, based on what I wear, I'm trying to be eye candy. Mm -mm. I'm soul food. <laughs> I am soul food. I'm not afraid of your rejection. I'm too kind to myself to stop what I need to do for Christ based on an outfit, a wardrobe. I am too busy working for Jesus to fear what man can do to me. They can harm the outside, but they cannot harm that inside. It took a long time to get here. Don't, don't, don't get it twisted. I didn't, I didn't start there. <laughs> But if I want to go ahead and be kind, I'll go ahead and ask, can I be kind? And I accept the, per the person can say yes or no. I accept they can want my help or not want my help. It's up to them. I accept. I don't withhold my kindness. I offer it knowing that it could be rejected, but it is not personal if someone rejects your kindness. They're not ready, and that's okay. It's okay if they're not ready for your kindness. But to stay away from regret, I still offer it. Now let's see what Psalms 27 is that what I wrote down there? Actually, nah. Let's do 1 Peter chapter 2, verse. That's the second epistle. So we want to do the first epistle. 1 Peter 2, 4. Let's hold up the luck. <laughs> to whom coming as unto a living stone, disallowed indeed of men, but chosen of God, are precious. Disallowed indeed of men. Disallowed indeed of men. Rejected. For those who are rejected by men, God holds precious. Those who God choose, those who God put in place, those who God show kindness to are precious to him. Those who God, not man, man's rejection is not God's rejection. Remember that. As we continue to illuminate kindness and dark spaces, even at the fiesta, in me casa. I pray that you enjoyed this week of kindness with me, that you were able to laugh a little bit as I spoke. 
not from my emotions that sometimes are in a dark place, but I spoke from the source of light, the Bible. And I tried to illuminate the kindness that I struggle with myself personally when it comes to others. I even have a little note here that I would like to read and it says, I'm sharing my testimony. I love to be kind to those who like love and at least speak but petty betty <laughs> comes out if i don't i don't want to be petty even though sometimes i like to be so i remember from pastor davis hurt people hurt people praying that god will heal and help remove our insecurities hurt which is the root of our meanness and asking we will be vulnerable instead by showing kindness. That's it. By showing kindness, by being vulnerable. You get to the root of it. So let's pray. God, let's get to the root of it. Let's get to the root of our means. Let's get to the root of how someone hurt us. So then we learned how to hurt others and it stuck. Some of us had a bad attitude <laughs> just from day one. I've seen some babies, woo. So God, as we develop to be reborn again and born into your likeness and your character, help us to be mindful that rejection cannot stop our kindness. We can ask and we can give the opportunity. We should not expect it. That's a big word there. It's hard for people not to expect to get what they put out. But help us to remember that Jesus died for us. He should expect more from us, but he doesn't sometimes. He gives us grace and mercy, and we thank you, God, for that today. By the power of the Holy Spirit, in Jesus' name, amen. Continue to have a wonderful weekend, prayer partners. I've had a blast this week at the Fiesta in Mi Casa. I look forward to uh, seeing you all next week with a different fruit. As always, enjoy Jesus.